Hey, welcome, it's me, John. Welcome to another food review with me, the only food reviewer on YouTube that doesn't have a stupid intro or catchphrase. And today I am at Wendy's to try their new chicken sriracha sandwich, as well as sriracha fries. I'm going to taste them, tell you what I think about them, and that's it. No, no they're garbage. So, this is what their chicken sandwich looks like. They supposedly have sriracha in the bun, sriracha in the aioli sauce, and sriracha in the jack pepper cheese. Let's taste it. Let me tell you what I think about it. It has a nice blend of lettuce. It looks like spinach. And some uh, red leaf lettuce. Um, there's bacon, the cheese, the sauce, and the chicken. No tomatoes, no onions, or pickles, or anything like that. Let's give it a try. Okay, first impression, everything tastes really fresh. Oh wait, there's red onion in here. I have one red onion in here. Was that a mistake or did they just not put a lot on there? Anyway, distraction. Everything tastes really fresh. The bun, the lettuce, the chicken, the bacon is crispy in there. Crispy as it can be underneath all that stuff. The sauce, uh, it's spicy, not very spicy. Uh, I don't really taste anything in the bun. Let me just taste a little bit of bun by itself. That one has some sauce on it. Let me get some sauceless bun. See if I can distinctly taste any sriracha. I do. There is a Pepperiness to the bun. Very good, very good. The sauce, I mean, you're definitely going to taste something there. The jack cheese, you can see some peppers in there. I don't know how you make a sriracha cheese. Although it is have like a nice pepper kick to it. So all three things they say have sriracha in it definitely are spicy. And with the fresh vegetables on top and the crispy chicken, this is actually a really good chicken sandwich. Definitely have a napkin ready because they put a lot of sauce on here. Especially if you have facial hair, it's going to catch in it. Now, I just tried the Sriracha Big Mac. And like, you can't really do a comparison head to head with a chicken sandwich. First of all, because it's a chicken sandwich and it's a burger. But secondly, the Sriracha Big Mac was trying to modify a pre-existing sauce that already has a distinguishable flavor. And they did a really good job with that, adding a spiciness to it, but still maintaining the classic, this is definitely a Big Mac sauce type of flavor. Now the sriracha sauce on this chicken sandwich didn't really have to do that. It just had to have its own unique thing. And it really is good. It's spicy, it's creamy, 
it blends well with the sandwich. Uh, like I said, it tastes of the bun it has pepperness to it. The cheese has a nice pepperness to it. Every part of the sandwich really goes well together. I'm going to have to give this a 9 out of 10. What could they have done to make this better? Not sure, but just saying that this is a really good sandwich, but it's not blowing me out of the water type of thing. 9 out of 10, definitely good sandwich. Moving on. I just wanted to just finish that. Moving on, we have the Sriracha Fries. Now, these Sriracha Fries have the same aioli sauce plus bacon. And I think they're supposed to have cheese in it, but I don't see it from on top. Maybe if I move... There's no shredded cheese. Maybe the sauce is mixed with the cheese. Oh yeah, there's definitely cheese in there. You can see it. So let's taste this. Nice. Uh, it's falling apart. <laughs> Talking too much. Some bacon, some fries, some cheese. The cheese and the sauce are both similarly like, colored, so you can't really tell if you're getting a lot of cheese or a lot of sauce in the bite. That sauce is definitely nice on the chicken sandwich and in these fries. And the bacon just adds a little salty crunch to it as well. I definitely like what they're doing here. However, the lettuce and the bun kind of like give you a little uh, coolness to the sandwich. I wish there was something that added to this, maybe like a ranch drizzle to it. I think it would like really make the the, the dish better because right now it's a lot of one note kind of things and the potatoes don't really the, the fries don't really have too much of a flavor to them to combat the the spicy saltiness on top that being said it's not bad I like it the bacon, the sauce, the cheese, everything goes pretty good together. Uh, I'm going to have to give this one an 8 out of 10. So overall, both very good items at Wendy's. Tell me what you think in the comment section below. And once again, thank you for watching my videos, even though I don't have some ridiculous thing that I say at the beginning and end of everything. Anyway, that's it. See you next time. Bye.